This is certainly an emotional time for families and those surviving victims, many back here at the club for the first time in a year. Some still recovering not only physically, but mentally as well. A very touching moment when 49 angels representing those lost arrived. Invited guests allowed inside the gates at 1 a.m. The owner of the club, along with Orlando's mayor, with words remembering the victims. Loved ones telling us being here is hard, but one step closer to closure as well as healing. Nothing like this should have ever been allowed to happen. It's just monsters walking the streets and one of them just walked into this club a year ago and for no good reason at all decided to open fire. And then 49 families will never be the same. It's painful because you just want to be able to hug them, you know, like you have all these families that are missing them, but it is at the same time, it's so good to see so many people here supporting each other. This morning's vigil, part of a day long of activities being dubbed Orlando United Day, a day of love and kindness.